Well, it's Friday. It's uh, almost the end of October, and uh, today's the day. You gotta go on a little adventure. Try to find a scrapyard that'll buy all the all the good stuff. So, uh, as I do all my scrap pickups during the summer, you uh, kind of get some other goodies that you know you just put aside. All kinds of stuff, a little bit of everything. So most copper I've ever had at once. Whole barrel full. A little bucket of brass there. Get all the AC parts, electric motors, compressors. Of course, all the ACRs. And then uh, we got some stainless in there. Big sheets of uh, stainless steel that uh, pretty interesting. Never really had much of that before, but of course we got the bucket of cords. Couple grill tops. Don't get too many grills up here in Maine. People like to people like to keep the grills and fix them, keep them going. This is uh, all those aluminum radiators that I got from that body shop. I was cleaning out. It's uh, again the most aluminum radiators I've ever had at once. Uh, they're, they're stacked up almost to the sides back here and uh, never really bothered too much with them before you have to you gotta have a lot of them to get something so I'm interested to see um, of course the prices of uh, metal are way down um, but the non-ferrous metal which is all this kind of stays you know stays okay so um, but getting into winter and uh, I was gonna save all this up till next year but I decided you know let's clean up and uh, maybe uh, maybe we'll be getting steak tonight I don't know could be hot dogs could be steak. You never know. She's squatting. She's squatting just with that stuff in there. Some pretty good weight. Got uh got about a hour and twenty minute ride to the uh scrapyard that I want to go. So I don't know. Hope it works out. Just gotta check the oil in the old, uh, the old stove. Make sure it's up and uh, be on our way.
Well, as always, you expect a little more. Yep, that's what we got. Of course, you're always expecting more. But, I was hoping for more around 500 for that load, but uh, a couple of things I like about that scrapyard and uh, a couple of things I don't like. One thing I don't like is, uh, this is this is what they give you for a printout here. It just says the pounds. It doesn't even tell you how much it was, like, per pound or how much the, you know, the price was that you got for each kind of metal. It just just gives you that so I don't know I guess it really doesn't matter but it's just nice to to know how much you uh, got for each thing you know that's what I like to do anyway but what are you gonna do the other thing I don't like is on the other side of this is a check said online that they pay cash but I guess for uh, non ferrous metals they pay by check but it's the same bank that I have so whatever so it doesn't look like uh, doesn't look like steak tonight not really enough to uh, justify that so I don't know but I know one thing stopped for lunch Yep, said screw it, stopped off in Bangor, and uh, if you've never been to a Five Guys or you don't have one around you, it's pretty awesome. The fries are, uh, they're like homemade fresh cut fries, and uh, they fill the cup and then they just dump another big tray load into the bag. Burgers are awesome. It's like a diner style, flat top grilled. It's a little pricey. A little pricey. Double bacon, uh, small drink, and they, they have grape soda, by the way, which is awesome. My standards. And uh, regular fry was... Uh, just over 15 bucks so it's not cheap not like going to McDonald's but it's uh it's nice the the buns toasted and uh, all the toppings are free and get as many as you want so that's what we're doing hmm They're messy. Got droppings everywhere. They give me napkins too, unlike a lot of those other places. When you don't want napkins from those other places, you know, you go to McDonald's, Dunkin' Donuts. When you don't want them, they give you a thousand of them in the bag, but when you need them, you get something you're really going to need them for. They don't give you any. Must be expensive. Napkins are expensive. Fries are awesome. They cook them in peanut oil. Yeah, it's all bad for you. I know. Anyway, the, uh, the thing I did like about that scrapyard was very easy 
people were really nice. The guy was really cool that uh, ran the little little building there, that the non-Ferris building. And uh, one thing they do is they unload everything for you. I mean, I kind of, I got up in the truck and, you know, sort of fed him the stuff out of the front of it, but he wanted to do everything himself. I guess it's the same with the metal. You know, you just take, if you take light iron or whatever in the back, they, uh, they make it a point to um, help you unload it. So, that's pretty nice.